Hello Z-Bird and welcome back to Mario Tennis Aces and today we are moving back into the action with some online tournaments with a character I've been wanting to play since I knew the character was in the game which was back before it released. So this has been a long time coming. We are finally playing Chain Jump, a character I have yet to go against online. Nobody plays this guy apparently. On his racket it sort of just looks like Pac-Man. But you know what, this ain't no Pac-Man. He brings Pac-Man and he makes him look like, I don't know, a baby. No, I didn't want to go no. I wanted to search for an opponent. We're more ready than ever. Continue. Uh, he is another power, power character. And if you've been seeing my recent episodes as I play power characters, I'm not so good with them. But he's Chain Chomp. I can't not do it. It's going to be exciting and fun and interesting, right? So let's give it a shot and see what ends up happening. Oh, man. Don't know who we're going to go against. I've been getting my butt beat by characters like Peach the last couple of episodes. So, looks like that Peach didn't want to play regardless. That's fine, that's fine, it happens. Um, but I'm interested to see how Chain Chomp works. Some people have been telling me that Chain Chomp is really good. Some people have been telling me Chain Chomp is really bad. So we're gonna find out together if it's a character for me, at the least. It's so fun because Chain Chomp has been a character in Mario games since Mario 2, Mario 3, maybe Mario 3, Super Mario Bros. 3. A long time now. And he's been a pretty big staple character. He's in most Mario games now, you know? But he's never been a spin-off character. I don't think he's ever been in a Mario sports game as a playable character or like a Mario party or anything like that. So let's see how much fun we have with this. Now the weird thing about, of course, Spike is that he doesn't have any kind of arms or even proper appendages to hold it except for his mouth, which is, I wouldn't define that as appendage. But uh, I mean, he can still hold the racket. So who's telling this guy now? Nobody. Don't deny a chain chop his dreams. Oh boy. Oh no, it hit your shoe. Is your shoe okay? Oh boy. Well, that's our first point is Chain Chomp. How exciting. Ooh. Come on. Ooh. Decent drop shot. Smack it that way. And I want to see what his special move is. Ooh. He grips his. I, I'm like, I I'd imagine that he's like afraid of breaking the racket. Whoa. Or just like, you know, chomping it, you know? But I guess, you know, he might look mean on the outside, but maybe he's quite delicate. Ooh. I think we'll get the mind games working on the Peach right now. Uh, because she just. Don't even go for that one. Oh, there we go. That was a pretty good one. And then I'm just going to, I was gonna lob shot it, but I guess I might not quite need that. Oh, here we go, here we go, boom! What a great flat shot right there. That was really cool. <laughs> okay, this is going very interesting. It just, it just sits on his head. Whoop, yeah! Oh, okay, that was an interesting serve. I guess he sort of has like a higher point of serving than most other characters, because one thing you don't really realize how large Chain Chomp is in this game. And the fact that it sits on his head as a starting point, you know? Ooh, interesting dive for the trick shot. Because when you throw it up, yeah, that's much higher. Because remember, most characters that throw their ball up in the air, it usually reaches the bottom of the bleachers in the background, but here, it just like is way up there, and you can really tell when it serves. So like, I feel like that's like an interesting advantage he has is the literal height advantage that seems like most other characters do not have. Even like Waluigi and stuff. So we're winning this one pretty well. Very interesting. Okay. Ooh. Okay, not bad, not bad. Got that charge slice and that's gonna get us another point. We're on our match point now. So I'll probably go ahead and Hope that you don't special, you will special. Should I special her special? That usually almost always doesn't work. You know what, I should've, I should've. Oh well, that's fine. Let her have the point and then just, you know, zone shot her. It's gonna be smarter. Got it. Oh, ooh, you got it. And there we go, game set and match. Interesting round to start things off to say the least. But hey, <laughs> pretty cool as well. So there's that done and as you can see, our results are looking pretty good. 18,000 points earned up. That seems to be pretty average for a game that long. All right. Um, so let's go ahead and keep moving. I think things turned out pretty well there. So our first game with Chain Jump has been won. Let's move on to the next game now and see what ends up happening from there. You never know. We're about at 6,000 points, which I'm really excited for. That would be awesome to see before the month ends because we're getting close to the end of the month. I'm recording this on like, what, the 26th? So we're getting there. By this time next week, it'll be a new month, which means I'll be able to play whatever new character's coming up, which is super exciting. We're going against Bowser Jr., the recently nerfed character. Let's see who can handle this. Power versus defense. 
I think that he might actually have an advantage against me. But it would be, aw, oh, Connect was unreliable. It would be so cool to win a tournament as Chain Jump. Above a lot of characters, I feel it could be really exciting. So we'll give it a shot. We'll see what ends up happening as soon as I can. Right now, we're sort of waiting it out for uh, a player to play against. What do you know? All right, so we got Chain Chomp. I think we're, yep, we're going against Spike, the character I played as last episode. So let's see how things end up working out with this. Might be good, might be bad. So far, good start. Maybe we can really utilize the lack of range Spike has. We learned all about that last episode. Oh, come on. I wanted to try. Oh, I don't know. I didn't know what shot we're going for there, but I got a lucky body shot. I just love spinning around the spike. It, not spike, as chain chomp. It's super cute. Oh, I got that nice serve. And there definitely is like a crazy point, like a curve downward. That's just like unlike literally any other character. That was really bad of me, by the way. <laughs> he just drops it and gives up. The poor thing. It just makes for an interesting serving experience. Ooh, bad connection. Bad connection. Okay, this is already game point. It goes so high, it like goes into the, the UI telling us how fast the ball is moving, which is like also our best point like frame of reference. So that's interesting for sure. Anyways, we're changing court, we don't have to worry about it anymore. He gets a serve. So we won the first one with quite a lot of dominance. Uh, and it looks like so far that's happening with us against Spike at the moment. Oh, that was a really good top spin. Just slamming it to the other direction. All right, ready for this dude? I'm gonna... I don't know what I'm doing, to be honest with you. Ooh. Okay, that wasn't exactly what I was looking for. Whoa, dude! That was insane! Oh, I love it. Oh, he couldn't quite get it back, so that's 30 love. Things are going pretty well at the moment. I'm gonna drop shot it, see what he does about that. And then I'm gonna... Whoa, get some major lag. Major, major lag, but that's gonna be 40 love. Sorry, unfortunately, can't catch up to that one. All right, match point, here we go, here we go. Got the drop shot, and then let's go ahead and do our special. Oh gosh, here comes Zebra's Unleash. Guess that's what this is called. He just swings around and around. Whoop! It's not really all that much of a flashy move. Like a lot of the other characters have like this really flashy kind of, whoa, look at this thing that references my character in some way. Chain Up just does a little spin. I mean, that's fine. Don't have a problem about it. All right, so that was a good round now. We broke that 6,000, which is amazing. And we, we are now two nothing with Chain Jump. Very exciting. I mean, that might go down the drain very soon. It almost always does, but we can try it again. There's a lot of Peach and Spike in this tournament so far. Like there's three Peaches, two Spikes, a Donkey Kong, and a Jane Chomp. And now we're going against Yoshi. Going against a lot of uncommon characters for online tournaments, at least for me personally, comparatively to what we normally go against. So this is interesting. But we'll give it our best shot. <laughs> I mean, we're going at least against, you know, a nice variety of different characters. Power characters, technical characters, and speed characters. All different character types, so it'll be interesting to see how Chain Chomp handles all of them. Oh, that wasn't so good. Let me go ahead and do that, and then, oh, that's what I was gonna do to you! That was what I was gonna do to you! Dang it! Oh, well. Guess I wasn't ahead of the curve as much as I thought I was. I'm not able to get too much of a charge out of this stuff right now. Oh, smack that! And then, mm -mm, not happening. I'm trying so hard for the lob. This never works. Ooh. Ah. Whoa. Whoa, boy. Okay, so the good thing is I'm keeping him low on energy. And then I can just do this, boom. And he's not gonna have too much energy to do something about it. He does do something about it still, but he's even lower on energy now, which is really what I was looking for. Oh, okay. That was silly of me. That was, I just should've went for it. I'm still like figuring, I'm recording this right after the Spike episode. So there are gonna be times where I'm just like, I guess playing as if I was playing still Spike. All right, I got this one, but now you know, he's earned up his energy back in that time. Whoa, -ho -ho. nice charge shot that really wind my energy back up. You know, we're going for it again then. Well, like if I can really wear him out, I don't know why he's getting so close. I think he's trying to bait me to get closer. I mean, hey, get as close as you want, dude. Mm. Okay. Oh, yeah, he definitely was. He definitely, definitely was. Blocked it, okay. Oh, gosh. Oh, nice, we got him. There's our first point of the round. We had to fight for that one. 
So I'm gonna go ahead and try to make him get all close, and then we can just... And that's interesting about Chain Chomp, is he doesn't really have a backhand like other tennis players would, because he's just spinning anyways. You know, like what's the... I mean, maybe he'll have to spin slightly farther, depending on his positioning, which could be more difficult, I suppose. Um, oh, you used your energy at the wrong time, buddy. I'm so sorry. I'm gonna try to shoot at him. It's like this, boom. He's not gonna go for it. Okay, he actually intentionally moved out of the way, I think, so that uh, he wouldn't feel tempted just to hit it and probably break his racket. I think that's what was going on there. Maybe not. Okay, he's gonna smack that. Being a power character, I can handle it. Mm. So now I have like a major power advantage. Ooh, and I'm working him. He thinks he's getting away with stuff, but he ain't. Oh ho ho, right on past him. We have taken the lead. Nice stuff. I have a little bit more to do, and then we have our special. So go ahead and hit that back. See what's gonna end up happening, dude. This might turn out our way. Okay, just smacking it that way. He might actually slow down for it, and he will actually get it, but he doesn't have too much more. While I do have a fair amount more. Back it up, back it up. Smack that. Okay. Mm, okay, he's really using a lot of his energy for that one. What are you doing, Jane Jump? I don't know, but it's working. It's working. Uh. Mm, I'm trying so hard to do a lob shot. Like, I'm pressing A and B, and it never works. It's ridiculous until I don't need it to anymore, and that's insane. It's like literal insanity. I don't know if those like certain requirements have to be met for a lob shot, or if the game just doesn't like me. Whoa! Oh, come on. Now it's tied. Wow, we both worked really hard for that one. I'm not letting you get this, Yoshi. I'm so sorry, buddy. But it can't happen. I need to win. I need to win a tournament because I haven't in so long. Okay. He's actually getting some good work done charging up. Ooh. He actually might be able to use the special in a moment, so I gotta be real careful. And he's gonna use it. I'm not too surprised, gotta be honest. Okay, so where are you gonna hit that? Right here, blocked it, nice. So he's gonna really develop a lot of his energy into trying to uh, stop that, which I think could be good for me depending on what opportunities I can take. Okay, mm. not really going the way I wanted it to. Oh, that might hit the net. It doesn't, but it gets him a body shot. Okay, that's good, advantage 40. So we're taking the advantage, which is great because he had to you know, use all of his energy to get to that point. I know that feeling. And there we go, we get the first game. Awesome, it's been an intense battle between me and him. Okay. Boom. So oh yeah, since I haven't asked yet, I was like thinking, I was like, am I forgetting something? Since I haven't asked yet, what are your guys' thoughts on Chain Chomp and Mario Tennis Aces? Do you think he's good? Do you think he's bad? <laughs> Do you think he's over in the middle? Do you play him at all? Do you main him? And of course, if you have any tips for me, I would love to hear it. Hmm. I mean, so far, it's just, I mean, things are working out pretty well. I mean, I'm sure they can go better. They can always go better. That's what I was trying to do to you. It wasn't really working. Okay, ready? I'm just gonna, do. Okay, I know that one's gonna launch over that way, but that still wasn't enough. He is destroying me right now, and that's destroying me, you know? <laughs> it's destroying my, my happiness. Okay, mm. Gonna smack that, and then we're gonna, oh, should've just won for the special. Dude, get out of here with that. You know what then? I don't think he's gonna expect this, so. Oh, too early, dude. Gotta be careful. Mm. Gotta be careful. Gotta be careful. Mm. There it is, I thought that was gonna happen. He thought I was gonna hit the other direction, which is great. All right. No, boy, don't hit that, or you should. Oh, it was a fault still. Whoops. <laughs> okay. Thought it was gonna be a body shot. But I don't think it could count being a body shot. Oh, no, no, no. The connection's getting bad. I can sort of feel it. Ooh. Okay, not bad. Whoa, come on. He got the first, or the second game. So I gotta win two more. Jeez, it never ends. Come on, come on, that's not bad, not bad. Yeah, once you get those corner drop shots, those are really effective. So we're gonna go, go ahead and do our special. Hopping all about, having a good time. 
Uh, we're just gonna smack it that way. And he is gonna hit it, but will he hit that? No, he won't. Get out of here, buddy. So now we're really taking this one, but I have no energy. Luckily, I'm a power character. The whole point is to be able to build up a lot of energy. Cause he, whoa, come on. Is it frozen? Connection's bad? I can't do anything. Don't adjust your television screens. This is not the recording, a communication error. Does that mean I won? Hey, that means I won. <laughs> not the way I wanted to win, but okay. Challenge another opponent. I guess it does, I guess that's so weird. Search for opponent. Is that really how I'm gonna win my first tournament as Chain Chomp? I mean, we still have the finals to do, so if I win that, I still win. And it's gonna be against a Donkey Kong, which we haven't fought a Donkey Kong in today's episode. So that surely is intense. Yeah, let's go for it. Oh boy. Can't believe that just happened with the Yoshi just disconnecting. I don't think that was intentional, of course, but here we are at the finale. Two game, one set match. I know, it's a Marina Stadium. It's finally time for the online tournament finals, Kev versus Zebra. All right, well, <laughs> I still look like, whoa, he's in the cage. Oh, the poor guy. Well, none of that, okay, he gets out no problem. <laughs> I, I think that might be for maybe his own safety as well. well. I mean, I guess not. What's gonna beat up a chain chomp? Maybe DK, the two big powerhouses. Jane Chomp, just like Spike we talked about last episode, he's sort of another character that just sort of does what he wants. He's not really angled good or bad as much as he is just for himself. And in Mario's perspective, that ends up being bad, but I don't think he's actually quite the enemy as if, you know, Bowser and the Koopas are. It's more of this, that's just sort of a danger with the environment. Can we get that power shot? We can, but it's not gonna be too much more than that. So right now I have a huge energy advantage on DK. I would like to continue for as long as possible. There's that lob shot, beautiful. I actually did it intentionally for once. Okay. And there we go, we get the first part of the finals against DK. All right, DK, what you gonna do? What you gonna do? Mm. And then we're gonna go ahead and go for this as soon as we can. You're at half energy, so if we could drain that even farther, that'd be great. Smack it down that way. And I don't know if you're actually going to, oh, you will, but then I can just do that. And, oh, back it up, back it up, back it up. Okay. Oh, not bad. Still have that energy advantage, which is really nice to see. And then I can just smack this this way. He doesn't have too much energy to stop, stop, so it's too early for him. So we've already done our first little bit of racket damage, which is great to see. I'm gonna smack it that way. I don't have too much energy for this one. Ooh, his first racket's almost down. Whoa, what a shot. All right. Come on, Chain Chomp, we can do it. We might have totally lucked out to get here. Or maybe we would have won that game anyways. It was sort of too early to know. Cause I won the first game, he won the second game. Oh, you know what? Oh, I should have gone for that a little bit better. Here we go, here we go. Shoot it right at him. He, didn't, he went for it, but he didn't quite get it. And that's something, that's an advantage I want to take, you know? Okay, go for him again. Will he swing for it? He will, but he actually lands it this time. Look at you. Charge for that, and then, ooh, that was a scary drop shot you just did. Oh, it's gonna hit nothing but net, because I wasn't actually expecting that to happen. Oh, he's really excited about it. Okay, he got his first point. Gotta be careful of that. Okay, mm, that was not a charge. It feels easier to charge our shots as, ooh, chain chomp than like most other characters. Just because he can roll around, or I guess Hopper, and he never really rolls. Just because he's always staying face up. Okay, you know what, we're gonna get, start going for that zone shot again. And while he will get it, I don't know how often he's gonna be getting it because I'm gonna be doing it again and again, as soon as I can. But he's gonna go for it again, and he actually gets it, but Will it continue? I feel like I just need to actually technically play instead of trying to do the zone shots, because I'm trying to force a KO. But that could be risky. But anyways, we get game one. Very nice indeed. Change card. Change card. 
All right, so now I get the serve, and this is where I could try to push for even more stuff, especially since he has no energy at the moment. I can go for this, and that's gonna be our first racket break. He's down the one racket. If we do this correctly, we can win even sooner. But I mean, it, this might actually be a 2-0 game kind of thing. There we go, 30 love. I feel so bad. I feel so bad beating anybody in the tournament final, just because it's like, you have to really fight to get here, you know? And that sticks, just because you have to fight to be here. So I don't want to take that away from anybody. But hey, I might not have to. This guy might take it from me if I'm not careful. Okay, so he's really gonna go for that one. And then, oh, body shot. <laughs> Oh my gosh. It's funny when you think Chain Chomp's just a very large tennis ball. I mean, they had that in uh, Mario Tennis Ultra Smash, a tennis game that shall not be named, except for apparently I named it. Um, because in that one, uh, you had the really big beach ball. So it's like, <laughs> that was in essence the size of Chain Chomp. Okay, ooh. There we go. Okay, here we go. I could have probably just smacked that and gotten a point, but DK has some large range. Whoa! Whoa, I was not expecting that angle. Oh, that was bad. <laughs> he actually got the point from that. I was not expecting it. That was an okay serve. Could have been better. Mm. Oh, that was a mistake. Okay, I need to do just more top spins, I think. He's having to use his energy to keep up. Back it up. That was nice. And then, let's try this again, see if this is any better. Now that he has no energy to really, truly stop it, I don't think. He's gonna really slam it in that pocket. And he missed it just barely, but it's still a miss, which means we're tied up. If I could just hit his racket twice more, damage his racket, we win that way, which I still think I need to probably force to win this game. Let's see if he goes for that. He does, he actually gets the block without it actually having any energy behind it. So good on him. I'm gonna let you do that every time now. Keep that in mind. All right, he's hitting back pretty well at the moment. Oh geez, that was messy. Oh, he has the advantage now. I need to be real careful. Okay, try that up. There we go. Nice, Deuce, back to tying. Okay, come on. Ooh, that's me being a dingus. That's me being the biggest dingus ever. Jeez, come on. We're at the break point now. Get out of here with that. I'm like so focused on winning this. Okay, perfect. Thank you, oh, you're gonna slow down for that one. I don't blame you. Okay. I need to be careful because he's really trying to earn up his energy now. I mean, the thing is, is that he hasn't, oh, there we go, back to time. Oh my gosh, we're fighting for this one. It's just a constant back and forth of who's gonna get the more dominant shot. We're both doing flat shots a lot. I feel like it'd be smarter if I did some top spins. I knew you were gonna do that. All right, now I do the flat shot. Oh, he actually has it. Will he use it though? Ooh, boy. I don't know if he's just gonna use it now. Will he think to? He won't, which I think is gonna be a big problem for him. He should have used it there, and there we go! Advantage! Okay. Championship point, will I win it? Oh, that almost hit the net. Come on, come on, come on. Get that lob shot. He is going to smack that thing. I can use some of my racket as well. Oh, and there we go. I feel so bad. I feel so bad he just barely missed that one. <laughs> All right, we actually won a tournament. Lucky or not, a tournament win is a tournament win. Me and Chain Chomp went all of the way, beating Peach, beating Spike, making Yoshi disconnect or something, and then beating Donkey Kong to get this beautiful, beautiful online tournament trophy. That's our third online tournament win, and that's gonna bring us almost to 7,000 points. We broke 6,000 and almost made it to 7,000. Crazy awesome stuff there. I had a lot of fun with Chain Chomp. Zebra takes the win! Uh, Zebra really got it. Okay, so we, we did just talk about some blah, blah, blah. Until next time, farewell!
Can't believe we won a tournament as Chain Chomp, though, out of all characters. That is super duper exciting. And with all that being said, that's probably where we'll wrap it up for today's episode. I had a lot of fun, hopefully you did too. And next episode, we'll be trying the final character we have, we have yet to play, which is Koopa Troopa. So stay tuned for that, and then stay tuned in a couple days. It will be August, we'll be checking out whatever August character there is available. But with all of that being said, thank you guys so much for watching today's episode of Mario Tennis Aces. If you watched this part of the video, make sure you comment Chain Chomp Zebra so that you've watched at the end that you are a Zebra Tassin viewer. Check out more episodes like this one on your screen right now or by subscribing to join the Zebra Herd. Either way, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye bye.